I need to know, is there, like, any guys left that, like, believe in, like, opening the car door for a girl, you know, being there for her, supporting her, being loyal? Is there any guys that can be loyal anymore? Or any guys that just want the girl they are with and not multiple other girls? I need to know, is there any of y'all left? Because I cannot find them. Anyway. Short answer is yes, these good men do exist. It's just that most of them are either married or in long-term relationships that they are loyal to, or they're just single. They're either working or they're hanging out at home because they haven't been able to find a woman that appreciates a good man. A woman that wants a partner rather than just another guy to financially support her. And yeah, these are the men that if they were in relationships, they would absolutely be chivalrous. They would open the door for you. They would absolutely be loyal because honestly, you're gonna have a hard time convincing them to not be single. They're definitely not going to want to be double not single by having like more than one woman in his life. Excuse me, yeah. You there who says, um, where's all the good men who will open the doors, who are shivers? Yeah, you. Question, where were you? You make a sign these men were invisible. You make a sign men just like disappear off the face of the earth. Where were you? I know where were you. You probably would flirt around with every Tom, Dick, Harry, Chad, Pookie, Ray, Ray, Tyrell, flirting around, playing with them, if you know what, if you know what I mean. Or you probably focus on your career. And then you start looking for these men who you want loyal to you, to be chivalrous to you, you can't find them. As Emily would say, these men are either married, engaged, or in long-term relationship with women who are willing to do that who are with good women, who they're chivalrous to. And having multiple women, that makes zero sense. I don't understand how these kings going hundreds or thousands of years ago have about dozens, if not thousands of wives. I understand you want to like keep the bloodline going, but bro, you're thinning the bloodline a bit much. Point being is that where were you where you were younger and you have access to all these good, chivalrous men. Where were you? The question is not, you know, where are the good men? They've always been around. You just probably choose to know them early in your life because you're younger and more beautiful. I have access to men, what a matter of means. I mean, meaning men who have a lot more money, the top one percenter. But the problem is these top one percenters got multiple women and won't take relationships seriously. The guys who like the, like, you know, the lower... 70 to 80 percent, those are the men who will be loyal to you. Those are the men who will be chivalrous to you, but you choose to ignore them. Now, all of a sudden, you appear. Now, all of a sudden, you say, like, Where's all the good men? Where's all the chivalrous men? Well, they've been around since day one, but like she said, married, engaged, long term relationship, or oh, you have almost forgot. And quite a few of them choose not to be dating because they like being single. <laughs> no drama, no headaches, peace. Right now, men are chosen peace over foolishness. I said what I said. Leave your thoughts in the comments down below if you think you have another answer. Peace.